Hey guys, Kev here, and this week on Beat at the Movies, we take a look at new horror A Quiet Place, starring Emily Blunt and John Krasinski, who also steps into the director's chair and has a writer's credit. Now, the film has only been out for four days, but it's already grossed over $71 million at the box office from a budget of around $17 million, so it's safe to say that this film has been a major commercial hit. But will it go down in the history books as a great horror? In my opinion, it's a resounding yes. So we're introduced to the Abbott family with Blunt and Krasinski as the parents. They've survived a post-apocalyptic attack by alien invaders who use sound to track their victims. Therefore, to stay alive in this world, you have to stay as quiet as possible. As a result, the film is mostly silent. There's little or no dialogue and communication between the characters relies on body gestures and sign language. But it's not a silent film in the old school meaning. This film has an amazing use of sound and a great score. So you never really think you're watching a silent film. The film does an amazing job of preying on your nerves and I have to say that I spent a lot of this film watching through my fingers. It's tense, gripping and original and if a horror can take all of those boxes then I'm happy. I'm going to give this one 9 black puddings out of 10.